Well, good morning. Well, maybe not good morning for whenever you're watching this, but it is six in the goddamn morning for me. And I don't know why I get up this early to go fishing. It blows my mind what I do to go off fishing. But anyways, I'm at the lake actually already. I forgot to um, make an intro at my house. But whatever, I look crusty, super early in the morning, whatever. I did want to say really quickly, I wanted to say I'm really excited for this partnership I have um, on the pro side for um, Dark Horse Tackle. If you guys haven't heard of them, they're a smaller company, but they have really great bass baits. Um, they just came out with some new um, crank baits and jerk baits um, that are, I mean, they look, I'm not just saying that because I'm part of the team, but they, they actually look really, like, really good. So um, they have this, like, monthly subscription box you can get um, if you use my promo code right there, Beats Time Pro 10. You can get 10% off any single purchase you get on that website. So, I recommend go check them out. I'll give them a chance. They got really good, cool-looking baits. I think it's better than the Mystery Tackle Box. I've I've gotten both of them before. So, like I said, um, really appreciate if you could just go look at, check it out at least. If you don't, I'm not saying to buy anything, but just go check it out. See if you like anything. And, uh, yeah, I really uh, recommend getting that box. So, anyway, get back to the video here, Brandon. Uh... We're going to catch some like 10 inch gills hopefully. I've been going out the past couple days, not been doing good. Well, I haven't been doing good. I've been in a fishing slump lately, only been getting like one or two fish every time I go out. So hopefully today's redemption day. We're gonna be out here for freaking the whole day. I set up all my tip ups and stuff for, uh, I mean, I got four carbon leaders on there. I'm going hardcore today. So um, we're gonna have like six tip ups up because we're gonna have three guys out here. Then we're all gonna be jigging for some big, big, big blue eels, maybe some crappie and stuff. So anyway, Hopefully we can get some fish for you guys finally. You know, I've been posting like a week now because I've not been doing good fishing. So anyway, I gotta get my bibs on. I gotta get sled ready. Um, I'm waiting for these guys to get here and we're gonna head out on the lake, take the walk out there. And yeah, we'll see you guys um, probably when I'm, we're out there drilling holes. So see you then. Is that a long walk? Holy shit. Sorry about the wind. It's gonna be a little freaking windy today, I'll tell you that. But honestly, I don't even need my coat on. Yeah, I'm just gonna drill some holes quick, find the right depth. We're fishing in the same spot we usually do, and we got a couple other spots if we don't get any here. I'm gonna start jigging right away. My dad doesn't have, I gotta wait for my dad to get here because he has the minnows and stuff to tip up, so. I guess if I wake up this early, I get to enjoy this great view. That's uh, God's creation at his finest right there. I'll see you guys when we're slamming some fish. There you go. They're about Freaking eight and a half. Yeah, there you go. Last one. Another yeah. nine inch gill. There you go. Awesome. Yeah, I'm just setting up uh, some tip ups right now. I'm trying to find like 15 foot over there and then uh, I'll come back to jigging and stuff. So I'm gonna get these out and then uh, see you when I'm jigging. All right, a little update. Just got this freaking magnum if I can show you. Look at that thing. Woo. Just a magnum. Yeah, we've been, I've got two so far. I think my dad has like four. We've been just going from like hole to hole trying to find uh, a couple fish and then you usually get like one or two marks and you'll get one of them. Today's menu, Jack Links instead of kick ass today. Spicy, of course. All right, guys, I just got the biggest freaking bluegill of my life here. 10 inches all day. It is just a pie plate. 
we just moved spots. We were over there. We got like probably like six bluegills, and then we weren't really marking anything. I came over here. I didn't get the hook set on video, but we came over here to the new spot, and I just caught this freaking tank. I I mean, this, <laughs> if you want to get comparison, this is a this is a a freaking gallon bucket. Ten it fills the whole across. thing. So yeah, one more look at her. Bring get a couple pictures, and then yeah. See you back at the next fish. Yep. See you then. All right, what's going on, guys? This side fish bro just went off. There's actually another flag up over there. All right, I'm gonna test it. Here. I just ran. We're like way over there. Damn it. Something on this one. I'm gonna get him next time he stops. Oh, this feels heavy. It's coming like right to me. I think. Still got a lot of line. I don't know. He's like coming right to me. One minute. 37 seconds later. Yeah, I know. He doesn't want to come up. No, he's no. You gotta get a set. Oh, no. Oh, dude, he's bigger yeah. than you think. He's, well. He's 10 pounds. What? Yeah. You think he's a 10 pounder? Yeah. Just tire him out, though, bro. Oh, oh my god. god. It's the bobber. Stop. Is that your video on? Yes. Sure. Cool. Try to get him up. Oh, no. Don't touch the line. I'm trying to get him up here. Whoa! <laughs> yeah! Whoa. Perfect hook set. Oh, now that's a pike! Guys. Woo! Oh, that's, that's a 28 all day. Oh, yeah. Look how there. thick it is. Yeah. Boy. Yeah! <laughs> awesome. You want to get him? Well, that out. was freaking exciting. Freaking 10 inch bluegill to this. I mean, we might keep this one. We might throw it back. Hang we don't on, know yet. On. He's we'll looking up. Show, he's down. looking up the what the uh, legal limit is on this lake. So that'd be a perfect eater though. This lake is super, super clear. But if it's over, I think it's 28. That was one of the best fights I've ever had on a tip up actually. All right, awesome. I think my dad's gonna fillet that one up. And, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna get a couple pictures of them and I'm gonna set up a couple I'm gonna get these tip set back up and hopefully we can keep on catching some more fish. It's gonna be an awesome video. Alright guys, we just got done getting that pike and now this flag just went up right after we were about to set the other one up. We saw it spin super fast, but now it's kinda stopped here. He might have just went he might have just went straight to the bottom. Heard some leaders on here too. Nothing, right? Spit the hook. Damn. All right, well, we're going to get this one set back down, and and uh, they're hidden right now. It's crazy. Well, we just got another flag, but we think we think he dropped it. The line's pretty much just straight down. No. Yeah, it only took, took like four feet. four feet out. That was probably the first flag since we missed the other one. We just had that one. We probably we had four, four flags so far, that one pike that you guys saw. And... Uh, this is a couple like small perch I didn't show. Um, we're trying to find the bluegills still, but uh, they've been seeming a little tough to catch right now. We might go try uh, a little bit deeper holes and stuff. So, yeah, hopefully we can get some more flags. I want, I'll take another one, one of those pike any day of the week. Let me tell you. See if we can connect on some more fish for you guys. Stay tuned. You won't be pissed. All right, guys. Well, we we're on a little lull here, and this flag went up again. It's spinning pretty good too. Got him? Awesome. Huh. Swimming right at me or soft? Just keep tight line. Yeah. Small one. Ah, not bad. Little chunkers. Bad one. Not bad. It's better than what we usually been getting at the other lakes. Alright, well. Back and hopefully we can get up. 
get some more towards darker. We're gonna stay here all day. So. What is happening, everyone? I got sunburned today. I'm loving this. My face is beat red. But anyway, this is the outro. My eyes are like super red. Nice. Probably from the sun and the snow. My blue, baby blue eyes. Virgo, baby blue bungalow eyes. Anyway, I just wanted to say thanks for watching the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. I got that huge freaking probably my biggest bluegill i've ever got in my life and then we got that really nice pike too for around the area i live in that's a pretty that's a nice pike that's a pretty big pike for like around my area so i was pretty happy with that um i just wanted to say um don't don't forget to check out um dark horse tackle the website um i'll leave the link at top of top of my bio and use that promo code right here uh, for 10 percent off i um, really appreciate it and yeah, um, this thanks for watching it. Please like, please comment if you guys want. I like the comments. I could have filmed a little bit more footage, better footage. I forgot my GoPro trusty, so I only have my phone. So I was just trying to do my best. And we weren't getting like crazy, like action bite, bite, bite. It would be like a bite every 30 minutes or like a bite every hour. So it was just kind of hard to film, but um, hopefully you guys still enjoyed. We got some nice fish today. And uh, tomorrow I'm heading up north. Actually, um, I'm not. I'm gonna try to do some fishing, but um, I got some other stuff I gotta help my grandparents up there with. So some chores and stuff. But anyway, um, I might. I might film. Try to film a video up there. I'm not really totally sure yet. See if how much fish we catch and if they're even biting that good up there. But anyway, without further ado, thanks for watching the video. Beast dying out.